Well, that was accidental. How's it going, everybody? Everybody doing good? You may notice a slight change from the norm. Try and guess what it is. Now, let's go with the manual save. Yeah. Manual save. I see I'm just here talking to myself. That's fine. Anyway, let's begin, shall we? This is gonna take some getting used to, to say the least. Oh, I see. Huh. Maybe I should have gone with the autosave. Possibly. Loses his precious map. Law follows him to the eastern beach. Oh. Huh. That wasn't even any further. My bad. What's the matter? Oh, Gary! Someone showed up! I was beginning to wonder. <laughs> How you doing? Yes! Oh! That's good to hear. Notice anything different? Hmm, let's see. Let's teleport over there. Yes. Didn't quite get me over that, but whatever. It got me where I needed to be. Sate. You wanted me to look into the war that happened here. And if there's one place I'll find records about it... <laughs> it would be a reference room. There must be one in the biggest building around here. <sighs> Didn't I tell you? I can help you with directions. I even have a map to the base. Rule, Rule. I take my eyes off you for one second. Just how did you get here anyway? There are shortcuts all over the island, you know. I guess you still have much to learn, huh? Oi, oi. Keep him in check, will you? Eh. Sorry about this. I promise I will. I will. I promise. Rule. I know how much you want to go, but let's sit this one out, okay? If you're going to the reference room, it'd be faster to go through the back door. And leave through the northern exit, it's less guarded. <sighs> you sure are something else. <laughs> Keep treating me like a kid, and I'll make you regret it. You better watch out, Law. Good thing. My voice is more real. I can't tell if that's good or bad. I'm going to assume that's good. Yes, I got a new microphone. It didn't arrive quite in time for the last live stream, but this is its maiden voyage. What the hell? Oh, I can't be spotted. Crap. Is that so? I didn't realize this was a stealth mission, my bad. Well, at least I have teleportation. That helps. Oh. Yeah, maybe if I paid attention to this log... Maybe if I paid attention to this, I would have realized. Let's see. Where's a good spot at? Oh, crap. Damn it. 
These guys are bastards, you know that? I hate mandatory stealth missions. This game isn't the best for stealth, I gotta say. Saturday. I mean, at least it's more forgiving than older stealth games, but... This is mostly an action game. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll have to take an alternate route. Trying to get through the front door isn't gonna help. Funny, after he said going through the back door would be the easiest, I try to plow through the, first, the front door anyway, almost as if I don't like to pay attention. <laughs> Kinda funny how that works. There's a lookout up top as you go under. Oh, look at that. No fall damage. Good. I guess I better keep under wraps as much as I can. This seems more like a preset path than anything. Like, you gotta go a certain way, and you gotta figure out what way that is, you know? Ah, shit. See what I mean? There's a predestined path here. And if you don't stick to it, well, then you're just screwed. Damn it. See what I mean? Funny. Well, considering this mic is worth over $80, I really didn't. Came in a Velcro carrying case and everything, so you know it's not cheap. I'd better be more careful. The place is crawling with guards. Let's move this mic over a bit. My hand couldn't quite reach the keyboard. Oh, I see. It's almost as if their backs being turned were deliberate. This is probably the path I was meant to go down. It's... I don't know if I'd call that a gimmick. Having different options. Huh. Yeah, it's not gonna be a thing. I'm not actually being hired by YouTube. Oh, shit. Damn. Practically got eyes in the back of their heads. Yeah, it's more like they're everywhere. Man, it's a shame I can't zoom in on this. Okay. That's just to give people options while they're doing different things. This wasn't made just to live stream with, you know? Hell, people have used this to sing with. These options are probably for people like that. Or maybe for different circumstances. Oh, crap. Okay, he didn't see me. That was just me marking him. That's actually a good thing. That's me noticing him. Actually, I could take them down. I could take them out. Stealthfully. That would probably be easier than just trying to avoid them. No, then I'd get the other guy to notice me. How utterly annoying. Just need to mark him down. Probably better to just go this way. And once I have them marked, it actually shows where they're leading, too. Um.
Well, what do you think of this? Hmm, another one, huh? Well, I could try to take him out. Or I could go the ultimate stealth route. Maybe I should switch the device that I use for this, because I cannot see a damn thing on this little iPhone. It's too far away, I can't even see the live chat, which kind of defeats the purpose. Hmm, nobody back here. Oh, never mind, there are some people. This doesn't seem right. Go unguarded. Once something happens, I think I'm going to switch out what device I'm using to display OBS on. They didn't realize just how small it is back here. And again, like it got even smaller somehow. Okay. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad that's a thing. Of course, since this is a desktop microphone, I could always get closer. Of course, you probably wouldn't want me to get that close. Keep my distance. You don't want to smell my breath. Now, let's see. Okay. It should be good to go from here. Gotta make it over here. Yes. Once I found this path, it was almost too easy. Yes. This looks like the entrance. Guess it's time to pay my respects to the end of a grand adventure. Is this it? I see. Unlucky indeed. A kid's father was in the process of mapping the island and ended up finding a dinostone. Whispering sweet nothings to our ears. Hey, Delzert. The Navy asked for information, but for some reason or another, Rulay's father refused. Naval records say he was a cohort to pirates, and that pirates were also the cause of his death. Was he betrayed, or was it just some cover-up? I suppose the truth will never see the light of day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So apples really don't fall t too far from the tree. Both of them are walking the same path in life. <laughs> Did he really see the map? Unfortunately, that's not for me to si really keep the map, I mean. Unfortunately, that's not for me to decide. <laughs> Intruder! After him! Okay. What's all the commotion? Don't tell me. Is that kid here? Well, hopefully I don't have to stealth anymore. Actually, I think the problem is... OBS likes to display the chat really small. Kinda weird. Hm. Oh look, it's Smokey. Oi. Haven't seen you since Punk Hazard. Why do I always find you in unwelcome territory? You don't hear the music right now? Uh. Just following some ex-admiral's suggestion. Take it up with him. So. What's that guy thinking? Sad. I'm done here. You'll let me through, won't you? Fortunately, you may be done here, but I'm not. He's on there. Okay, I guess we get to fight now. Sweet. I'm sick of running around. Sneaking around. Attempting to sneak around. Great, it's two on one. You call this a fair fight? Ah, crap. How about this? Take this. Oh boy. How about this? 
Yeah, boy. Ah, crap. Damn it. Friggin' two against one. How's this even remotely reasonable? Try some of this on for size. How about this? Oh boy, shit, he, he can break through my guard too. I need to find some way to make OBS display the live chat bigger because unfortunately I can't read a damn thing anyone's saying. And I mean that too, I have to put it right up against my face to see what you're saying. Which means I actually have to physically stop playing. Sorry. Seriously? What is with the two of you working together? That doesn't seem very reasonable here. Damn. And just when I think I've got good timing. Shit. Ah, shit. Every one of my moves is missing them badly. Take this. That works. Oh boy. Need to get the hell out of here. Ah, shit. Piss off already, would you? I can just take out one of them. Shit. It can break through your guard, too. There's literally nothing. You know what? Uh, to hell with this. Hold on a second. Sorry, but this was really annoying the piss out of me. OBS displays the live chat so freaking small that my phone couldn't possibly keep up with it. Now at least I can read what you're actually saying. Because now I'm using my much bigger tablet. Should be much better. To be fair, they're teaming up on me. I think she, she dug her own grave. Besides, this is what equality looks like. I need to get more aggressive. I'll take out Smoker first, then. Take this. Great. Gotta love when their iframes make it so that they become immune to my attack. Just because you were a second too early. I'm pretty sure she's not. She made it pretty clear that she hates the Straw Hats. If I could separate them somehow, that'd be great. Ah, shit. Ah, for frick's sake, come on. Well, I can stun both of them with the same attack, so that's something. If they aren't down on the ground, then they're freaking... They're using moves that makes them invulnerable to attack. 
Hard to get any good moves on him. Very funny, Neo. Man, even you're playing into that, aren't you? I mean, to be fair, it is two on one, so... If you could summon someone, I would just be making it fair. Ah, shit. Which could be an annoying fly. You want to be first, then, huh? You want to go to the front of the line, huh? Keep in mind, that has peril. Take this. I'll kill you both at once. If I can take her out, it'll be much easier. It's hey, screw you. Seriously? You can just randomly teleport. Yeah, fuck you if you want to get a hit in. You just teleport out of the way. Because, you know, that's, that makes a lot of sense. Why even bother having ultimate moves then? You're not actually gonna get them off. Shit. I think you mean your luck is. Did he? Did he seriously just wrap the entire goddamn battlefield with smoke? Seriously? I'm getting sick of this bullshit. Come on. You can't target one of them without the other one kicking your ass. Honestly. I thought a cage I thought Akianu was tough, but at least there was just one of him. There are two of these people and it's very annoying. Good friggin' grief. I guess the one upside is that you can stun them. I guess that's why they're so easy to stun. You're supposed to fight them one at a time. Oh, look at that. I've got all three. Not that it's going to do me any good because I don't have any moves for that. Quit doing that, please. Please quit teleporting every time I'm about to hit you. I don't know. I consider that reasonable. Okay, go screw yourself. Getting me off screen. I'm focused on one. That's really reasonable. Ah, shit. Take this. Would you quit doing that, please? Honestly. You gotta be ashamed of yourself. Think me up on one guy like this. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You're supposed to be a navy captain. You gotta team up on me. You got a two on one, one person. You're a disgrace. Supposedly a good swords swords master and a navy captain. They have to team up on one guy. Ah, shit. Cut it out, please. Oh, I'll just avoid it with my bullshit. You're not allowed to focus down one of them. Because the other one's going to kick your ass. You know what? At this point, I don't think there is anything... I don't think there's any shame in just running around, because seriously, they want to be bullshitty about this, I'm going to be bullshitty about this too. I can be bullshitty about this too. All night long. And fail at it, because I can't dodge them forever. Really. And of course, he's going to use projectiles. 
Just to make sure that I can't focus on one of them. Even when I think there's only one of them. For fuck's sake. Both of them can teleport all around, so you can't separate them ever. There you go. Ah, fuck. Come on, come on. Come on. Oh, god damn it. Ah, shit. I might take her out, but god damn it, he's gonna take me out too. Did I mention that this is complete horse shit? Because I think this is complete horse shit. And I will say that. There's probably a trick, but I don't know what it is, unfortunately, so I guess I'm just gonna have to die. You know what? I can teleport too. I should use it more. Okay, go screw yourself, please. I can't even hit one of them. Beginning to wonder, Neo. I'm beginning to fucking wonder. And you're not. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah, shit. Yeah, that's not gonna help me too much, especially when I do it random. Really? Oh, look at me! I'm just gonna cover myself in smoke and be goddamn invincible. Backstabber. What I think of you, backstabbing. Little. Really? You just finished your attack! How did you. How did you damage me after your attack was already over? I noticed that you stopped moving. And so I let my guard down, and then somehow I got hit. How does that even think? Ah, shit. I regenerate from that way too slowly. Actually, I think. I think you used it up just by attacking. Ah, almighty! Cut it out, please. The love of all that is holy in this world. You quit cheap shotting me, please. Really do not like the cheap shots. What did I just say about cheap shots? What did I just say about the freaking cheap shots, huh? I believe I said I wasn't a fan of them! And of course it threw me off. It fucking threw me off. I was about to teleport away from them and then they threw me off. Apparently they can throw off your teleportation if they're currently attacking you. Go figure, that's a thing. It's a thing in this game. Maybe right when they're about... How the fuck did you do that? And his attacks break through my guard, so nothing works. Nothing's good for them. Oh, fuck me. And she teleports multiple goddamn times in a second. You can't get away from them, you can't block them, you can't attack them, you can't do fucking anything except die. What am I doing wrong? What is the correct strategy here? What am I doing that... What am I neglecting to do that apparently I need to do? What the fuck? What needs to be done here? His dodging clearly isn't helping. Look at that. You can't attack, you can't dodge, you can't do anything. You can't get away with nothing. All you can do is hope that you can keep them down long enough. 
And even that isn't a guarantee. Because they will often break through it. They will often break through your moves, man. And if you attack one, the other one will get your ass. And you can't try to attack both of them at once. That's just impossible. Really? Didn't even phase you. Trying to use Amputate, but no, we, we're not going to get it out, are we? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. There is no safe time to do anything. There is only death and misery. If you think you've got them where you want them, they will teleport behind you and kick your ass. The hell is that all about? Oh, fuck. Can't even try to teleport here. Oh, of course, you dodged it. Oh boy. Yeah, see, look at that. She just teleports several times and gets you that way. Can't focus on her because then he'll get you. There are no safe moves here. Maybe I need to take... Okay, higher ground not working. Trying to use super moves not working. Trying to use literally anything not working. Trying to dodge them isn't gonna goddamn work because she will teleport. She will spam teleportation on you. That girl can spam teleportation. Far more than you ever could. This one boss, this one boss fight is going to, is going to put this death counter into the triple digits. Go to hell, Smoker. You know, I used to think you weren't such a bad guy, that you had some nut good in you, but now I just want you to rot in hell. Funny how that works. Because there's nothing honorable about you. Akiyano is more honorable than you because at least he's willing to fight me one on one. You tag team me with your friend. You're no honorable warrior. You're a disgrace. Both of you are a disgrace to the term warrior. My only hope is that. I can get them both lined up and somehow hit them before they hit me, which is easier said than done, I know, because they hit you extremely fast. The second they become vulnerable, they're immediately on the attack. When they don't have iframes, they're just in the middle of attacking you. You sure about that? I thought his, the point was he was trying to leave. That doesn't even make any sense. Tell me if that makes any sense to anybody. He's trying to leave, but he can't run. The parameter is you have to stay in this area because he, he won't run. But the whole point was he wanted to get away. So wouldn't it make things better? Actually, maybe if I... Maybe if I trip... Maybe I can trip them up somehow. Or not. Or maybe somehow they'll still have the advantage over me. If they can literally teleport and shoot me from anywhere they goddamn feel like it. Look at that, she just teleports and shoots and does everything. It's just getting old. What is the right strategy here? Because I have yet to find it. Did I just hear Mudabada? 
And there she is with the teleportations and the shooting and the every goddamn thing else. For those of you not keeping track at home, that is six deaths so far on this one fucking boss. And I thought Akiyano was tough. This makes him look like a cakewalk. But then again, like I pointed out multiple times, Akiyano was just one guy. Whereas these are two. And one of them can teleport anywhere she wants, and the other one can pretty much shoot you down with a spam attack. Either one of them would be bad to fight against, let alone both at once. Maybe the problem is I'm getting over eager. But how do I fight conservatively? I've been blocking, but they've broken through my guard so many times that I'm starting to think that it's impossible to guard against them. It's not like they haven't been breaking through my guard this entire time. Yeah, no kidding. You have got to be fucking kidding me! No matter what I do, they are always there to kill me! Just getting old right now. I don't have any special moves either, except for two of them. And neither one of them has been helping me so far. I mean, granted, I have the ability to teleport, essentially, but that doesn't help me when Miss... Little Miss Teleport Spam is right there to completely overwrite it. Excellent second thought. I could teleport and then block. That might be better. I haven't tried that yet. Okay. Oh, cool. Look at that. What the hell? What was that? I did some kind of sequence thing. Huh? It. I got an idea. Ah, fuck. Timing was off. Fuck. So much for that. Almost a little more. Little fucking more. Come on. If I can prompt her to teleport, then I can block it and then retaliate. God damn. Okay, she's down. Now if I can just hold out against this bastard, be in business. Oh, not so good on your own, are you? Son of a bitch, now you actually have to fight fair. Which means you have the disadvantage. Don't you? Look at this. Look at this bastard. Now that he has to actually fight me on him on his own. Oh, okay. He can still break my guard if I'm careless. And he can still spam smoke attacks. At least his girlfriend is down for the count. Take this. Oh, this is so sweet. So sweet revenge. To be fair, she was tag teaming me with this jackass, so he kind of had it coming. He had it coming. I'm a believer in equality. Could you come down from the ground at some point? You bastard. There you go. Now, if you don't mind, I got a battle to finish. Man, this guy's a cheap asshole. Even on his own. Take this. 
That is girlfriend. He's useless. Take this, you son of a bitch. See how far you go without her help. Okay, still pretty far, but that's beside the point. Asshole. Oh boy. Take this. I better get back into the bubble. Because apparently you're not allowed to fight wherever you want. Find you, son of a bitch. Shit. Yeah, your guard isn't unbreakable. Neo already made that joke, so you're gonna have to come up with something original, man. How about a scalpy instead? Yeah. I missed. Man, that would be so screwed up if I died now. And who knows, I might just. Finally! Finally. That was fun. It wasn't for me, La. It wasn't for me. So, you bastard. Oi. Out with it. What are you looking for? Some old records. Of one unfortunate adventurer who found a dinostone. Nani? A what? There's no such record! Even a vice admiral is clueless, huh? Seems he refused to help the Navy. Any idea why? He was probably in cahoots with pirates. Why else? Right. That was probably at another island. Prison Island is different. These people are suspicious of the Navy. So. To be honest, I also have my doubts about the Navy on this island. <sighs> this is rich coming from one of their own. People sometimes form their own factions. No organization is perfect. Ah. You said it. All right, we're done talking. I'll let you off this time. <laughs> That's my line. Either. Next time, you're coming with me. Set. The brat's not here, right? Time to go. Bye! Law, where are you? Law! <laughs> I heard his voice coming from the entrance. Let's go to skills and see what I can get, because clearly I am in need of some skills. Other than real world skills, but that's not gonna be ha that's not gonna be a thing anytime soon. Boost the dur armament hardening. He has armament hardening. Maybe I should have checked that. Ooh, unleash a powerful ranged attack. Counter shock, charge, reduce time. Counter shock, charge time. Okay, what about um, uh, tension three room? Hold Q and press space to perform a powerful area attack. Let's go with this. Bitchin'. Increase the damage of room. I'm gonna get my tension all the way up to 100. Let's increase my movement speed because that was pitiful. Okay. Increases maximum health and re health recovery. Unfortunately, I don't have enough for that. I will boost his attack, though. Because why the hell not? Why the hell not, indeed? Huh, Sturbin. Powerful range, yeah, that ranged attack thing. Increase the damage of Scalpel. Yeah, screw it, I could use a ranged attack. Uh, thanks, Elisera. What do you think, Neo? What do you think of the new microphone? Does my voice sound sexy? Am I sexy enough for you now? Oh, my kid, that was never sexy. Hi there, you think Boo's sexy? No. Wah, I'm glad to see you're okay. Hi. What are you guys doing here? Eto. We saw an admiral enter the base and... There you are, an intruder. <gasps> I'm so sorry. 
I know you wanted us to stay put. Save it for later. Stay back. Okay. Oh, it's a... The pacifista. I guess I can deal with that. I want to try the room attack, though. It's all about... Okay. Um... I'm a little too preoccupied with this fight to really argue with you right now, so... Sure. Take this, asshole. Oh, shit. That didn't kill all of them, and I'm, I've am i got very little health to speak of. Well, at least all of them aren't very good at following me. Certainly nowhere near as much as Smoker and that girl were. I don't even know the girl's name. I don't care to remember it. No offense, glasses lady. Swords woman. Swords lady. Man, they do a lot of damage for mooks. Oh, you gotta be goddamn kidding me. Well, my ego needs to not die. My ego needs for me to not get my ass kicked. No, that's not gonna happen either. Ah, shit. The hell? That didn't work. You gotta be fucking kidding me. A pacifista does way too much damage. All of them do way too much damage. There was supposed to be a fight of mooks. Oh shit. At least teleporting works well on them because none of them can move that fast. A tag team duo of Smoker. They could teleport too, which made it a hell of a lot trickier. These guys though. Oh, there we go. That's how you do the melee. That's how you do the ranged attack. Really? I don't have enough. Using the teleport also uses up the ranged attack gauge. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, you fucking asshole. Seriously? Take this, you best. God damn it! What the fuck? They just keep spamming you with explosions. How the shit? How in the fucking shit are you supposed to get around that? You know what? Pacifista dies first. I was gonna focus down those mallet guys, but you know what? The pacifista went up my target list. Bastard spamming explosions at me. Look at this asshole. Take this. Ah, shit. Take this, you bastard. Damn it. Ridiculous, man. Yeah, it only looks like it's those two left, but seems like inevitably, or join in. Come on, you bastard. Dance. Okay, his moves cannot be goddamn blocked. Good to know. Good to know that he just breaks through your block in one shot. Good to fucking know. What a prick. I guess that's why he's so lumbering. That's the fucking drawback. Oh, 
Go straight to hell. Injection shot Injection shot Could you stop with the spamming of the explosions and the everything else? I really don't appreciate it. Take this. Bastard. Oh, come on. How was I supposed to get away from that? There was no reasonable way to get away from that. Okay, that works, I guess. Guess with how slow he sometimes. Oh, fuck. He can just shoot it out of his hand really fast. He can't even get out of the way. Oh, good to know is AI can at least glitch out. There's a one thing, it's another. Really getting sick of this. Really getting sick of being spammed with everything under the sun. And I botched that up. At least their AI is stupid and doesn't know what to do with higher height elevations. Never mind, they know exactly what to do. They have some idea what to do. You gotta be kidding me. That was bullshit. Getting cheap shot from behind. By a goddamn laser explosion. When did the pacifistas become so freaking tough? They were nowhere near this tough before. I swear, they make- they made every enemy tougher. I know it's probably because it's DLC, but still. Fuck. If I had to guess, it's because Luffy is like a freaking tank himself. You have got to be fucking kidding me. Yeah, I know, that's what I was saying. Luffy's like a tank. Unlike Law. Oh boy. Son of a bitch. Hey, look, you can just spam it straight from his hand. And how are you supposed to dodge that in time, huh? There is no reasonable way to dodge that in time. You better hope you're hugging a corner. Or else you're screwed. Try this on for size. Yeah, like I said, if you if you're hugging a corner, you might be fine. Really? Really? Really, fam? Come on. It's hard to get moves out because they keep attacking you when you're about to do it. Oh shit. Oh boy. Huh. What's some of this? Huh? Oh boy, he's about to shoot. The pacifista, I mean, the pacifista is about to shoot. I guess after a while you get used to their patterns. You can pretty much tell what they're about to do. Or at least you can predict well enough. How about this? Oh, thank God. Is it over? I think it might be over. Sorry for being a whiny little bitch, but seriously, this is getting tougher.
Oh, great. Ooh. As if the Sky Prison wasn't enough for you, you just had to sneak into a naval base too, eh? Kizaru. You've even brought a woman and a child this time. Ari? What's that crusty looking map there? Don't tell me you're the son of the liar. Uh, who are you calling a liar, huh? Because Your father, of course. He withheld info about the stones he conspired with the pirates. A class criminal. No, no way, my father would never work with pirates. I... Don't listen to a word he says. Mm. If you're his son, would you happen to know where the dinostones are? Uh, what? Ooh. Seems you do know. <laughs> it's no use, you know. You can't outrun light. Why don't you tell me a story from the comfort of a prison cell? Hold your horses. I'm the one who knows where the dinostones are. Take me, but you have to promise to let these two go. Ooh. Aren't you Isaac's sister? Can you even prove there's any truth to the, your words? My mother was the leader of the people who was entrusted with info about the stones. Let them go and I'll tell you everything I know. Hmm. Hmm, I suppose you are not lying entirely. Well, thank God. I didn't want to have yet another fight. Oy. Why did you run? It was the best move. Huh? Liar! You just didn't want to get caught. Yeah, I knew it. You're just a dirty pirate you after all. Really just going to let her get interrogated? I don't think we have a choice. She wants to get interrogated. Pirates know nothing about family wanting to save them. Go run away. I'll go and save Genie myself. Pull your head. What? What is it you think you can do on your own? Seriously, what can he do on his own? Let's head back to Straw Hat ship for now. We'll need their help if we want to save Gene. Yeah, probably. I mean, I got my ass kicked by a pacifista. Clearly, Luffy is a little stronger than me. Relatively speaking, anyway. Consecutive takedown, uh, Nabel's perfect guard. Yeah, I'm not good enough for that. Hold on. Decreases damage take for, taken from ranged attacks. I think I'd better use that. I think I'd better get all these up to 100. Or, you know, at least these two, these two. Let's get myself a little tankier, huh? Hello, CODM deleted user 33. How's it going? At least I got that out of the way. I better go see the Straw Hats. Oh, that's good. I'm just playing me some One Piece. Come aboard and bring along all your hopes and dreams. Right. If it isn't Traffy, what's with the new look? And where's Raleigh? Isn't he with you? The Navy is Gene. 
What? What happened? Forget the details. We need your help to get her back. Okay, let me go get Luffy. The rescue plan to work. I need someone to take Jeanne's place. Take her place? Well, of course, save whoever is sitting in her stead. Straw Hat, I'll need you to divert their attention. Did you say dessert? What? No. I need you to cause a riot. We'll escape in the commotion. So who's going to be swapped in? They'd probably be suspicious if one of us ends up in a prison cell. Yeah. I've got someone in mind. A kid. Rule. You'd make a kid do something like that? Don't underestimate the Navy. We can't just barge in without a plan. I know, but... Let me worry about Rule. Actually, I need you to do something for me, Nami. Think you can restore this map? Huh? What in the new world? This thing's in pieces. Give me a sec. I think I can do it. Here, this should do it. This is a map of the island, I presume. Did you draft it? Yeah. Rule I did. Mm. Huh? I can tell he really loves what he does. A map drawn with such detail, it's not something you come across every day. <laughs> Yeah, he's really into it. I see. <laughs> I was worried about your plan, but now I get the feeling it'll work. Be sure he gets that map back. Uh. Of course. If he wants it back, he can have it. I'll fill him in on the plan. You guys go on ahead. We'll catch up. He's still in the city? Let's see... Steel City. All right, let's go find that kid. <laughs> Isaac's so cool. Oh. Well, he is the island's warden. Oh, come on. Nope, not here. Someone's got to have seen him. I need to find someone who has. Yeah, maybe. Oi. Have you seen that Rule A kid? Hmm. Huh, I did. Are you related to him? Uh. Well, you could say that. Ooh. Perfect. Take him home and let him rest. He was looking a bit sick, so we tried to stop him, but he didn't listen. Since you're his family, he may do the right thing and rest. <laughs> Would he care about that? <laughs> if he actually does what you tell him to do, that must mean he trusts you. To be honest, I thought he only trusted Jine. What a relief. Yeah, I saw him head towards the naval base. Hurry after him. Well, that's just lovely. He's gonna get himself killed, isn't he? That kid's gonna get himself killed. Oi. Have you seen that Rule kid? Ma. He said he was going to a hill with a view. He's always running around saying he wants to be an adventurer. I'm sure his father would be proud. <laughs> I heard he was associated with pirates. <laughs> Preposterous! That's just a story the Navy's pushing. Pops made that map for the people. He wanted to show them the beauty of the world. He said he wanted people to dream. How could a man with eyes lit up like that wherever he ranted about dreams be associated with pirates? Like father, like son. Ma. That's for sure. Rule looks just like him. He'd seem down earlier, though. Cheer him up for me when you get up to the hill. Sad. From what the villagers told me, he should be up on a hill near the naval base. I should probably get moving. Yeah, you would think it would be actually further in, I guess. Right, it is further in. Oh boy. Get the hell out of here. I don't want yet another fight. Eh, close enough. I went on the right side, but this works too, I guess. Oh boy. 
Eh, crap. All out of teleporter. But of course, it comes back pretty easily. <laughs> ah, there he is. Yo. Have you cooled off a bit? Nah. Tell me, was my dad really associated with pirates? Was he really a liar? <laughs> no idea, but... Some lies are told to protect others. Someone lied to protect me when I was young. You saw firsthand what Gene did for you. Surely you understand. I guess. Really? really. There is no right answer. You choose what to believe and what not to. <laughs> Alright! <laughs> La, I need your help. I want to save Gene, but I can't. Please, I can't do it alone. I've been ready since the moment she was captured. We have a plan. Really? What do I need to do? <laughs> First, enter the prison. Isn't that sweet? It's kind of funny how this game can piss me off like no other one minute and then get all touching the next. Ready to go. The trade with the sailors will take place at the naval base. Yes. It's time to start the plan. Let's save Gene. What do you guys say? Hopefully I won't have to fight Kizaru to do it. That would really suck. He was actually tough as Luffy. But I can only imagine now. Law is actually weaker than Straw Hat. Time to make a trade. Mm. Sure, the kid with info about the Dynastones for the girl. And don't you even dare think about using your abilities. The deal is off if you do. Huh. Of course. What else are these sea prism stone cuffs for? <laughs> okay then, send the kid over. <laughs> really? Sate. Your turn. <laughs> hmm. Sure. <laughs> You're an idiot if you thought I'd ever make a deal with a pirate. You really goofed up this time, Trafalgar Law. You even made it easy for me to arrest you. No. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? <laughs> Nothing is shameful when it comes to capturing pirates and gaining recognition. <laughs> you. You're a liar. And after they called his dad a liar, I'll put a sock in it, brat. Honesty isn't the best policy if you want to survive in this world. <laughs> I totally agree. Those aren't really sea prism handcuffs, are they? Uh. Well then. That was nice. Stunner, 
海兵ってのは相手が檻の中にいると油断するもんだいいか Dryad and crew, I need you to spread out and keep the Navy busy. You take care of Gene. Ah! You got it. <laughs> I won't let you get away with this. Hey now. You're fighting me, not them. Is that so? Is it time for me to fight? Take this. Oh, this feels so much better. Take this. Take out the officer. Alright, let's crack some bones. I agree, let's crack some bones. And by bones, I mean some skulls. Take this, asshole. You, out of the way, I'll handle it. Save the fighting for the sailors. I guess I missed... Don't worry about going all out. I'll heal you if you get hurt. Oh, I can't wait to get the room. That's gonna be great. You can actually use half of your health to increase replenish it faster, but I'm not gonna do that. For this action. This bitch. You're not getting out of this alive, you son of a bitch. Huh. Well then, you want a projectile, huh? Oh, crap. How come I can't do this properly? There we go. Damn it. Damn, using that is trickier than it looks. Seems it has to actually be an appropriate moment. Eh, screw it. Screw this. Here, I wanted a cool way to finish you off, but screw it. I guess we're just gonna have to do things the slicey dicey way. Bad news for you, friend. Bad news for you. That should be enough to stall them. The sailors are focused on the battleship. Battleship? No one will follow us if we go now. Yo! This bastard again. Ooh. Using a kid. You really don't think highly of the Navy, do you? I hope you're ready for this Trafalgar Law. Great, now I gotta fight him. I'm... I'm sorry. What? The Dynastones are on the floating island. I'll show you the way, please, I promise. Just don't kill me, please. Hmm. I wonder, are you speaking the truth? If you are, then I'd be happy. Let's go and have a look, shall we? <laughs> that kid's gonna get himself killed. I know I'm saying that a lot, but... I know I've been saying this a lot, but that kid is seriously gonna get himself killed. Can you hear me, robot? Nose? Oh, yeah. Loud and clear! What's up? Kizaro has Rule. What? I'm going to the floating island. Prep the Omni Cannon. You got it! Let's go, Usopp! Oh, yeah. Sounds like a plan! 600 skill points, baby. Now let's put them to good use. Boost these immediately. Yeah, I'll boost this. Two. I really need to boost myself and did not take so much damage all the time. Oh look! Recovery speed is maxed out. 
And let's max out my HP. I may not have gotten any stronger, but at least I can tank things a lot better. Maybe that'll prevent me from dying so much. Why would I need to quit dying so much? Because of this. I gained 10 deaths in one Let's Play. Man, that is embarrassing. But hopefully with this massive boost to health, as well as health regeneration, maybe I'll get somewhere. You can earn skill points by defeating enemies and completing missions. Isn't that delightful? By the way, don't tell anyone, but I didn't actually pay over $80 for this microphone. I got a pretty steep discount on it. Because I know where to get it. Windblade. Well. What are you, an officer? You must be because they bothered to give you a name. Ah, shit. Oh, boy. Shit. Just stun locking me like a bunch of bastards. How about this? Get wrecked, you asshole. Ah, shit. Huh. That's all you've got. You're the best you've got. Without your men, you don't amount to much, do you? You gotta love it when you got these tag team battles. It really annoys the piss out of me. I haven't had an actual one on one in a while. Then again, that pacifista proved to be pretty damn tough even on its own. So it's not like a one on one is easy. But these weaklings, man. Once you take out their teammates, they don't amount to much, do they? For the most part. Even Smoker didn't da really do shit. Ah, you cheap bastard. Unless they can cheaply teleport around like a cheap mother vicar. Take this. There you go, get sliced and diced, bitch. Huh, 30 skill points. Not a lot. But I suppose every little bit counts, huh? Sword Knot of Death Plans. I don't even know what that is. Anywho. I guess it's time to take to the skies. Again. Is everything ready, Nose? Good to go! Frankie went up already! I'm worried about Rule too, but the place is crawling with sailors. I'm gonna make him sound like Krillin from Dragon Ball Z Abridged, because why not? Make sure you're prepared. If you need anything, just say the word. Your thing. Thanks, Nose. <laughs> Apparently that's his name. His name is just Nose. Not Usopp, it's it's become Nose. Anyway. Did I I never equipped anything. I don't I don't even have any equipment. I should make something. What's up? Need something? Make some equipment for me. Nose. Oh, I can't make anything. Sword not of death. Imbued with a wish that you overcome impending doom. You need a lot of stuff for some of these, don't you? The nose knows. Okay, we're all set. Get up there. Yes. I should probably get going. I'm trying to make Law sound like the dub of Jotaro. Actually, Law in the dub of One Piece even has a Jotaro voice because he's voiced by Matthew Mercer. White Hunter. There you are, Treffy! 
I'm trying to make Frankie sound like his dub voice too. Uh. Yeah. Do you have any info on where Ruli could be? Kind of funny how Law is talking to Frankie, considering in the dub at least, Law is voiced by Jotaro and Frankie is voiced by Dio. Did you know that? Patrick Seitz. Oh, yeah. The sailors say he's in the northern base, the place that has a yellow crane. I got that. The northern base? Sorry, robot. I need you to keep the sailors here. Tell Straw Hat and the crew to hold them back, too. Ow! I'm on it! Take care of yourself! I'm glad you think that's cool, Neo. Let's save because I'm a scum. They call it save scumming, so I'm gonna save because I'm scum. Lol. I cannot see where I'm going. Probably could have taken him out, and that would have been a lot easier. Oh well. Seriously? Let me teleport already. Yeah. Because I was out of energy. Or whatever you call that. I was right. Attacking does were depleted. Damn. Damn. Okay, good. At least it replenishes quickly enough. Ah, shit. Good, they didn't see me all the way. Hey, buddy. Thanks, pal. Thanks for being an idiot. Getting the hell out of here. It's so scary. It's so scary, Yugi. Is there a way to speed it up? I don't think so. Oh, great. Another pacifista. The first one was such fun to fight. And judging from the looks of things, this is my welcome party. Ooh. Finally, someone I can talk to. <laughs> Your underlings fled, but you stayed behind, Admiral. The frog with law spotted. Bring him in with crocodile. <laughs> I don't have anything else to say to you. Huh. Yare, yare. Do I at least get crocodile's help, or is he just gonna fight me too? Take this. Take this, bitch. PXA. Cool. You want the dinosaurs that much? Well, that was a close one. Seems you can time it well enough. If you're lucky. I said if you're lucky, which clearly I am fucking not. A little hard to do that when I'm getting my ass kicked, don't you think? How am I supposed to do it when I'm in the middle of dying, Vegzy? You tell me. Why do you keep spamming that goddamn move? I'm sick of it. Please quit doing that. My health is already almost nearly gone because of that one goddamn spammable move. Bullshit, man. That is way too easy to deplete your health with. Maybe it's because I haven't been devoting enough skill points to making myself able to tank more, but I mean, I maxed out my health and I did something to improve that. Apparently he gets armament hockey later. But probably not now, because I can't change it. There isn't even a thing. I mean, in terms of difficulty, let's be real. World Seeker has it bested by a landslide. Okay, good. 
For once, I actually have someone on my side here. Oh, you have got to be fucking kidding me. Good. Crocodile can hold them off, too. You take on the pacifista. I'll try to take out the snipers. Maybe I'll get my room up. Which I just did. Ah, fuck. Hey, you want some of this? Take this, asshole. Okay, I'm running. Gym fragment and a gym. Cool. Oh boy. Okay, that pacifista is your problem again. At least for now. Hey, I was gonna kill that one. How am I supposed to get my tension up? Now there's no tension anymore. The good kind of tension. Take this, asshole. I can't. Ooh. <laughs> nice. Crocodile finished him off for me. I don't think this counts as a summon, considering he was already there. They're all gone. The Dynastones aren't here. You know where they are, don't you? Why don't we exchange the locations of our treasures? Treasures? Aren't you here looking for that brat who was with you in Sapphire Town? He's not here. The sailors moved him. If you're gonna make a deal, I'd prefer you hurry it up. When you find out the Dynastones aren't on the floating island, he won't even last... When they find out the Dynastones aren't on the floating island, he won't even last five minutes. It's complicated, Neo. I mean, he did help Luffy in Marineford, so... Is he a bad guy? I think he's more neutral. Dynastones are in the Sky Prison. Huh? Sky Prison? Oh, fine. You're not going? Thanks to some idiot going on a rampage, security is worse than Impel Down. I'm not about to jump in with no plan like some simpleton. <laughs> I want to see that idiot's face. Oy. The brat is in the southern base. <laughs> security is tight though. Don't get caught. I'm guessing that idiot is Luffy. Rulay's faux pas actually came in handy. Okay, there are cloud blocks here randomly. There we go. Well, yeah, it's more complicated than that, Neo. Crocodile's his own man. Very few of the characters in One Piece are definitively evil or good. Although I'd say Akiyano comes pretty damn close to evil, purely. That guy's relentless. I mean, not that, the, not that most pirates are much better, so maybe there's some justification there. At least to some pirates. Not all, though, obviously. Much of the world government and much of the pirates are full of assholes. For such an upbeat world, this sure is a crap sack world, you know? Oh, great, it's him again. That's... Kizaru! Oh. Have you found the Dynastones? Yeah. No, sir. There are a few potential finds, though. Ooh. You're useless. Guess I'll have to lead the search myself. Huh. What should we do with the child? Hmm. Let the officer take care of the kid. Maybe he can redeem himself after the mess he caused. Mazuna. I thought he was near Ralu... Really? Can't let him catch me. What should I do? Raffi, can you hear me? The sailors down here have calmed down. Is there anything I can do to help? Kizaru is here. I can't let him see me. Can you cover me? Of course. I'll be your eyes. Oh, here's a mandatory stealth mission, I'm guessing. 
Oh, shit. No, I don't want to quit. Don't lose your focus for a second. Hmm. There's Kazaru. Make your way through. Oh, boy. I'm gonna take down. I'm going to spot you. Hide. I can't believe I. I'm sorry. Of course. What do you know? Another mandatory stealth mission. Oh, crap. They better hurry up. Oh, crap. And unfortunately, I can't hide in barrels like Luffy can. Well, shit. Now what? Oh, I see. Huh, that's kind of funny, actually. Now's your chance. Make your way through. Okay, I made it. Good work, Traffy. You somehow made it past Kazaro without being spotted. Thanks, Nico. Graffy, do you need anything else? I'm fine. I owe you one, Straw Hat. <laughs> Don't worry about it. That's what friends are for. Right. Allies. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, go get him, Tra Traffy. For some reason I want to call him Tracy. No, that's someone else. That's four kids' versions of Ace. How dare you pull one over on me, brat? Seems you're no better than your good-for-nothing father. Once we find the stones, we'll lock you up. <laughs> Law will come for me before that happens. <laughs> you think a pirate will save anyone but themselves? You're out of your mind. You've been used and thrown aside by Trelfogger Law. That's all. Yeah. Law isn't that kind of person. He sure is a bit crude, foul mouthed, and that grumpy face hides in true, his true intentions. But he's saved me countless times. He's even helped the townsfolk in Gine. <laughs> You've really been duped by pirates. You're as dumb as your father. Don't you dare disrespect my father again. Cool. You really think your father is innocent of his crimes? <laughs> <laughs> You're a genuine, bona fide goof. <laughs> Grand Hogger D. Law. Someone's about to get their ass kicked. <laughs> well said, Rule. But stop talking about me like I'm some saint. <laughs> you're a pirate and all, but you're a good pirate, right? Stop giving me the creeps. Summer. You again! Why are you so set of getting on my way? Huh? You're the one in my way. He's this guy just wants to die, doesn't he? I think I'm gonna kill him this time. Or at least I wish I could. Take this, asshole. Man. Oh, shit. My bad. Take this. You bastard. Ah, oh, crap. He had the iframes again. I hate it when they get iframes. Take this. I'll knock you right off the ledge. Too bad it won't actually kill you. They just teleport. I mean, granted, you get that ability too, so... Maybe it's just making things fair. But this. 
Oh, you want to go, mother frigger? You want to friggin' go? Let's see if the iframes help you this time. Oh, I see. It just doesn't do that much damage to him. Real shame. Man, he is weak. He may have a lot of health, but he sure does go down in a hurry, doesn't he? Oh, boy. Shit. Try this on for size. Why don't you try this? Oh, you don't want to attack, huh? I can't say I blame you. I'd be afraid of me, too. Oh, look. He's trying that wind sword thing again. You're not any better than the last guy who tried that. And I figured out how to get around it. Let's see how many times I can knock you off this island before you stay down. Ah, crap. Whoop. If I'm not careful, I'm gonna die. Take that, asshole. Thankfully, they're slow enough with their attacks that I don't think they're gonna break my lo my guard. Ever. Never mind. Clearly, I was wrong. I underestimated this motherfucker. Shit. That was my L. I will take that. Fully. Shit, I was so close. That's the that's the worst part. It's one thing if you die near the beginning of a fight, but when you just about have their health depleted and then you die, that's the worst. You know what I'm saying? Oh, fuck. Take this, you bastard. I guess I shouldn't have relied on the block. That was my bad. I should have just staggered him. Would have been a lot easier. In fact, I'm proving that right now. I need to watch out, though. I can't just spam this forever. Dark Souls this may not be, but it still has a stamina meter. And if I deplete it, I'm screwed. Take this. Take this, asshole. Seriously? Barely even stayed down. Guess I'll give you credit then. Oh boy. Build up that tension. Huh. Right, I guess he's lost, so I guess it's called his room gauge. I guess with Luffy, it was called tension because he's made of rubber. So it's like gear 4 tension. You gotta remember that. Hey, asshole. What a dance. Teleport. Fortunately for you, not well enough. Take this. Okay, you want some too? I'll take y'all on. Room. Take that, asshole. Unlike your officer friend here, you can't take one of those. You die immediately. Take this. Amputate. Too bad it doesn't actually amputate them. Can you imagine? Ah, shit. Okay, there we go. Take this. The guy's got a lot of health, so you gotta give him that. He's very spongy. Ah, fuck. Try this on for size. He'd probably say the same thing about me, wouldn't he? You mean you can't teleport anywhere because you're on the edge. Literally. You're on the edge now, mother fricker.
Hello, asshole. Let's get him a little closer, shall we? Oh, that was fun. There we go. Yeah, I will fully admit that I let my guard down the first time. This guy is weak when you actually take him seriously. You're a chip off the block. The Dynastones being in the floating island. That was a lie after all, wasn't it? Since the two of you, you are together, I'll take you both in. Let's sit down in a locked cell and talk all about Dynastones. Oh crap. Well, this isn't gonna be easy. Can't even get close. If there's only a way to take him by surprise. A surprise, huh? I got it. Do you remember that one time? When I fell here? La, I'm going in. Stall him for me, will you? What? This kid's way too reckless. Yada yada. Guess I have to try and fight Kizaru. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Gotta hold up until Rally comes up on top. I guess I'll just have to run around. Thank God I'm not required to actually win this fight, I just have to stay alive. Staying alive, staying alive. Ha, 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 ha. Oh shit, you didn't. There was no bubble! What the hell? There's no bubble here. You didn't show me a damn bubble, that does not count as death. If I go out of a bubble or they catch me in a stealth mission or something, I do not count that as a death, and it should not count as a death. That's- oh, there is a bubble, I just didn't notice it. To be fair, this island is covered in clouds, so on the mini-map it's... That's quite so obvious. Ah, shit. Ah, damn. Let's try to hide. I know this may not be the most honorable way to win, but I don't really care. I'm trying to survive. Would you try this on for size, huh? Oh shit. Oh boy. How about this? Oh boy. Not just Kizaru, but we've got... This is how you can tell that Law is a lot weaker than Luffy. Because with Luffy, you're actually supposed to fight Kizaru, and you can actually beat him. I mean, he was tough, but... I technically beat him on my first run. But here... They know that Law is a lot weaker than Luffy is. He's a lot less capable of than he is. So rather than actually try to fight him, you're just supposed to stall out. Stall for time. Take this. What the hell this? Oh boy. How about this? I should take care of everyone immediately near me. Good. That should buy me some time. Oh shit. There we go. Unfortunately, you can't lose this. You can't lose their sight. They'll always replenish it. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You have got to be fucking kidding me. Okay, obviously that counts as a death, but still, that's bullshit, man. That's complete bullshit. Defeat the officer. Oh, okay. I see. Fuck you, Izaru. In some ways, you're worse than Aki Akiano. I said in some ways, not always. Get. 
I love how it's counted as a loss even if you're currently fighting someone. Makes no fucking sense to me. Oh boy. Zaro's gonna kill me if I stay out in the open too long. Hey, pal. You have got to be fucking kidding me. That's bullshit, man. Nani? I said Akiyanu. That's bullshit, man. Where it's like there's no way to actually get away. No reliable way anyway. Jesus, and once they start hitting you, you can't put your you can't even block it. You just get stun locked for a while. Well screw you if you want to actually do anything, they just hit you several times and you just gotta sit there and take it. What a bastard move, man. Look at that, you can't even do shit. I don't know how to pronounce it then. Does that really matter right now? Are you really gonna be a stickler about pronunciations while I'm dying? Really, man? Come on. Ah, yeah, shit. Maybe I can just spam teleport between two places. Yeah, that might work. That works. God damn you. Come on. How do you pronounce it then? You have to tell me how to pronounce it. Can I just call him the lava bastard? Will that work? Oh, thank God, I can spam teleport. Screw it. I don't care. Screw this. They're actually being honorable. I don't care, they're not being honorable. They're spamming me with bullets and everything else. What do I care about honor? Why should I care about my honor? But this. That ought to take care of him for a while. One more minute to go. I can do this. I can at least keep them busy for a little while. Shit. Shit. How about this? Take that, you asshole. I'll wait until they're coming towards me. There we go. Oh, fuck. I was in his line of sight. You gotta be goddamn kidding me. You've got to be goddamn kidding me. I'm already dead, you motherfucker. What point is it to slash at me now? Wow, is this AI even worse than Doom in some regards? Because even the demons on Doom... The demons on Doom know to stop attacking you when you're dead. So, does that mean that the, this AI is actually worse in some ways than the original Doom's AI? You don't even know when you're dead. Oh boy, shit. Cut it out. Man, it's, it's worse than the crystal sage, are you kidding me? Look at that fucking bitch. That'd be like if the crystal sage had explosions. Okay, so they were sort of like explosions, but still. They sort of lacked the explosive radius of an explosion. Oh, fuck, fuck. He's Louise, man. Uh, 
He breaks through your guard in a goddamn second. That is now 16 deaths in this one live stream. Jesus. That's almost as much deaths as I've had in the rest of the game. That should tell you how suddenly hard this has gotten. Holy shit. I swear to god, I'm about to die almost as much as I've done in the entire rest of the game in this one live stream. It's ridiculous, man. Even playing things conservatively doesn't help. I'm not trying to leave right now, but hey, if you want to be that way... Jesus. Maybe I need to have the teleporter constantly out. That'll help. Probably. Yo, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Take this. Asshole. He can immediately teleport and then shoot you immediately. If he sees you. Be a Delzert. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Too bad I don't have the same... Fuck you. Fuck you and your stun-locking bullshit. Come on, man. Well, that's one thing this Crystal Sage never did. Crystal Sage never goddamn stun-lock you. Jeez. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, come on! Quit stun-locking me, you son of a bitch! Hit me once, that's fine! Hit me a thousand goddamn times because you got me on the ground! That's not fine! That's not fine at all! That's bullshit! Stun-locking someone... ...is a bullshit mechanic in any game. When you're stuck on the ground and you are not even stuck on the ground when you're just stunned. Oh fuck. Of course. And of course my ass misses. Go to hell. Oh cool, that actually worked. Build him a one shot. Like this, asshole. There's no safe strategy. There's nothing even feels feasible. Everything carries a high risk of death, it would seem. Oh boy. Ah damn. Okay, go screw yourself. Just go screw yourself, pal. Seriously, I had a lock on his goddamn head and everything and suddenly it failed to shoot. Take this, you bastard. Asshole. There's no safe time to attack because everyone else hits you. I tell you, it wouldn't be a fraction as tough as it was if it wasn't for the fact that I keep getting dogpiled. You see, the naval officer by himself is nothing. Obviously, Kazaro by himself would be nothing because then I would just keep fighting. All of them by themselves would be nothing, and that's the whole point. That's the fucking point. The whole fucking point of this fight is that all these elements by themselves would be goddamn easy. The problem is you put them all together and then it's a recipe for disaster. If you go after the naval officer, then his men take pot shots at you and then suddenly you're stunlocked there. If you try to go after the them, then both Kizaru and the regular guys are after you. 
And if you just focus on, on trying to hide from Kizaru, then both the officer and his men get you. The multifaceted front. That ah, shit. And if you try to take out both the officer and his men at the same time, then Kizaru will probably get you because you're out in the open. Because there doesn't seem to be a way to beat them reliably and stay in cover. Find cover. Like this. Like this, asshole. Doing this. Quit stun locking me, please! Stun locking really sucks. I hate it so much. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. On the plus side, I think the bullets can be blocked reliably enough. Unfortunately, you can't say the same thing about his goddamn attacks, and then he comes out of nowhere, so you can't dodge him, so you can't block him, because he breaks through your block. If he gets near you and he's charging him an attack, you're fucked. You are just straight up fucked, my friend. There is no retaliation, there is only death. <sighs> ah, shit. Well, this is ridiculous. Take this, asshole. Ah, crap. How come I can't do anything while they're attacking? You know, I know that's not... It wouldn't be very realistic to be able to easily get in retaliation while you're getting shot at, but... Why, well, it's a video game. It's kind of why it's a video game, you know? You shouldn't be worried about what's realistic. You should worry about what's... I don't know, engaging? Fun? I don't consider getting shot at several times while well, you can't do damn thing about it to be very engaging. It just gets annoying. Is it my fault that that's happening? I mean, it's possible. Oh, shit. Huh. Because our attacks inadvertently hit them, because that would be great. That'd be great if I could use Kazaro's attacks against them. Take this. Oh. Fuck off, Mike. Ah, shit. Get. Come on, you bastard. Come on. Ease. There are no... There are no right answers here. God damn! Okay, it's official. Do I get to be Giorno or do I have to fight against Giorno? Because if I was fighting against Giorno, not that much would be different. I'm gonna tell you right fucking now, not that much would be different. God damn. I think the idea is you're not supposed to hide forever, but I can't rely as a I can't dodge his attacks reliably either. Kazaro's attacks may as well be a guaranteed hit if he spots me. Shit. Oh boy. Take this. Yeah. Oh boy.
Take this. He charge it. He does some kind of charge sword attack. Okay, if I was Jorno, then it would be way different. God damn. Then I would be the overpowered one. Shit. Ah, eh, shit. He's stun locking me with her bullets. I'm really getting sick of that. So cheap. So goddamn cheap. That's so goddamn cheap. Why do they keep hitting me with bullets? Why is it so easy to stun lock you with bullets? I just don't get it. I just don't get it. It's so easy to stun lock you with bullets that it just makes you wonder. It makes you wonder what's the point. What's the point of even trying to resist? Their bullets just hold you in place. Bullshit, man. You can try to hold out and get them to come closer to you, but then someone else will bullshit you. We'll just tag team your ass. There's no way to do this properly. In order to attack someone, you gotta come out of cover, unfortunately. Right now. Look at that. Help me in goddamn place for the motherfucking officer to come here with a motherfucking sword that can cut through your motherfucking block in one motherfucking hit. And then he cuts into like 80% of your health with one fucking slice. There is no right, uh, there is no right move here that I can tell. Because the Navy officer rushes you with his sword attack and does like 80% of damage to you. You get out of cover at all and then Kazaro just spams your ass with explosions. And then his Navy buddies just pelt you with bullets and just lock you into place. You can't even try to attack back at them because then you'll just get stun locked. If it isn't the explosion spamming, that sword that kills you in one shot. Like, I think the Navy officer is somehow more OP than Kazaro is. Go figure. Fuck's sake. Come on. Quit shooting me with your bullets! Jesus! Or at least quit making it stun lock me each goddamn time. I'm sick of their bullets stun locking you. How often in a game does a rapid fire gun actually stun lock you? There's not many cases that I can think of. Because obvious for obvious reasons that would be a little bit annoying to fight against. Case in point. This is why rapid fire weapons in most games do not cause stunning. Because it would be annoying to fight against. Case in point. God's sake. And you don't get iframes either. Between you and them, they get iframes and you don't. I don't think it's fair. I don't think it's even fair, man. You don't even get any iframes from it. You don't even get any iframes when you're down. You just get killed more. Oh, fuck. The only way out is to risk getting hit by Kazaro. But even then, I still get hit by bullets. To try and figure that one out. Get. Come on. Jeez. Fuck. You're spamming me with bullets, please. Fuck. If you touch his light even after it's hit the ground, it still hurts you. That's great. I gotta run, run around like a goddamn maniac if I want to stand any chance at all. And I said a chance, not 
actually win. Yeah. Well, at least they can go this far out, so that's something. At least I can lure them back. Fuck. Okay, just 14 more seconds to go. I think I can make it. 11, 10, 9, 8, please, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, no you don't, no you don't, the officer will kill you immediately, thank god I made it, after dying, I've died more than in this live stream than I have in my entire rest of this playthrough, but it's over now. Okay, great. Now I can actually fight him? Oh. Yeah, what did I fucking expect, huh? You gotta be goddamn kidding me. I was not prepared for that. There was no warning that you would end up fighting him. Jeez. The shit. What did he even do to him? Did he even slow him down? What was the point of that? He did that just to get one hit on him? What's the point of that? What was the point of that? Oh great, he can teleport. More than I can. Oh fuck. Okay, there we go. If I can hold out. If I can hold out long enough, I can get him. Shit, he can still break through you though. So don't take him for granted. Like this. Thank you. Get. Teleport. He's the living personification of that goddamn meme. It's not over yet. It's never over. I can't even finish this goddamn live stream because it doesn't even give you a checkpoint. You gotta beat this fucking fight, otherwise it's all gonna be for nothing. Oh no, don't even joke about that. Don't even fucking joke about that. You are evil, man. You are freaking evil incarnate. I swear. You're the most evil person I've ever met. You're just like Kazaru. You act chill, but then you're evil. You're just like him, aren't you? You act chill, but then you're just full of malicious evil. God damn! He fucks you up really fast! I can't even do anything to him! God damn! His attacks do way too much damage. Why does everything do so much goddamn damage to me? Seriously, my health and my health restoration are both at maximum. Granted, my protection against attacks isn't the highest, but... How did you attack twice? That's, I don't consider that fair. Getting around one of his attacks. Well, uh, fuck you. I'll just attack again. I'll just turn around slightly and attack again. God damn it. Take this. Heck ass. The one time you actually get in vulnerability frames is when you're doing a special move. I guess that's something. Oh, that is 
Take this. But I guess as long as I have enough room to do special attack. Fucking hell! I'll still get stun locked before I can get it off. Fuck me, I guess. Ah, shit. And then he'll just randomly attack with something else. God damn it. Okay, he stun locked. He got me in a combo. Fuck you. I know you compared this to Dark Souls, but one nice thing about Dark Souls is that at least you can roll out of the way after you hit the ground. When you get knocked down by an attack, at least follow up attacks. At least follow up attacks can actually be rolled out of the way of. If you get hit once, hit once in the goddamn fight. You are on the ground, and then he will, he will hit you multiple times no matter what. You are down for the count. You take one hit, you are guaranteed to take multiple hits at once. And they will eat into your health really fast. In other words, you get to the ground once, it's over. It may as well be fucking over. You may as well be fucking dead right there. I don't have perfect guards, so that's out of the question. What is it? A little late to tell me what to spend my skill points on, because I don't have any skill points for that. Yeah, shit. Actually, I have more room here. I should be trying to get him to fight on my terms. Why should I be giving him so much room to fight in? Oh, god damn you. How about this? Yeah, that only did worse for me. Hate it when he does that. That's not fair. Enjoyable fight? Have you looked at this? Have you looked at this lately, Vegzy? I don't know, is getting scraped up by razor blades inside a swimming pool that's full of salt and lemon juice, is that enjoyable? That should give you a good indication. Jesus. He, he breaks your guard too, so it's impossible to just use that. Take this. Well, that actually worked. Surprise. Oh. Even teleporting doesn't work. Teleporting doesn't even help you. Nothing helps you. You may as well just embrace death right here. Ah, he's using his ranged attack again. It is impossible to predict him what he's gonna do. I'll try one tactic, he uses something else entirely. Time for the projectile spam again. Better say Nani, you motherfucker. I can block him. Now I can block him. What determines this? I honestly wish I knew what determined that. Sometimes you can block him, and sometimes you can't. Not for fuck's sake. Try this on for size. Bastard. Jesus! What the fuck? This is bullshit. On another level, I tell you. I'm serious, this is the perfect storm of bullshit. I'm starting to think I'm not gonna beat him. Mm. 
Oh, try to dodge? Fuck you, you're gonna hit it. You're gonna get hit anyway. Fuck you and die. You're supposed to get away from that. A prayer? You're supposed to pray that it doesn't hit you? It's random and there's no way to tell where they're gonna land. God damn it. All it suggests is to just have have a move that you don't even have. You have to unlock that move. Oh, use perfect guard to give yourself an opportunity. If they don't have that, what then? What happens if you don't have that move? Well, I guess you're just screwed, aren't you? Guess I could just try running away from him. Good luck with that. See? See, sometimes that doesn't even work. Sometimes running away doesn't even work. Please don't ask me that question because you know damn well what the answer will be. I swear, you're just saying that on purpose. You know damn well what the answer is, so why are you asking the obvious? Managed to get away from him once. Too bad he, t he just attacks you again for no fucking reason. Get away from him once. Too fucking bad. Here's another one. When he notice that when he gets the attack off, he only attacks once. So you're thinking, okay, I can get away from that one. No fuck you. He turns around and he hits you again. Like, there, there's just no other way around it. I love how it acts like I can use Perfect Guard. Okay, I can learn Perfect Guard. I get the feeling that's not going to help me, though. Maybe I should actually try it. No, I don't want to fucking quit. I wanted to save. How much for that? Go to hell. Try it with perfect guard then. Good luck. Still have to have perfect timing. I don't have. See? My timing sucks. How about the room? Oh, that got a little bit of your health gone. Holy shit, it actually worked. That is a thing. Too bad I'm too weak. I barely do any damage to him at all. I barely even do any damage to him. Shit. I got it off once. Never gonna get it off again. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I pressed that goddamn button. Guess you gotta do it a mile away. 
Get used to this site. This live stream is never gonna end. Because it won't let you save. And I'm pretty sure that if I leave... I'm pretty sure that if I leave now, I'm gonna have to do the three minute one all over again. I'm betting I didn't even get to keep that. No, of course fucking not, because it doesn't let you fucking save. It doesn't let you fucking save. Good luck perfectly dodging anything. I got lucky the first time. Jesus. You're not funny. You never will be. You will never be funny, Begsy. Just like I will never beat this guy. I will beat... I will beat this guy when your jokes actually start being funny. Uh, I guess that'll never happen. That is bullshit, and you know it. I'm afraid your jokes are falling on deaf ears. Fact. You know what, I think it's about ready to just end this here. Why do you think I'm being silent, man? I'm being silent because it's far better than anything I could possibly say right now. You have no idea how much of a grind this is. I know it's funny for you, but it's not funny for me, and I swear to God. I swear to God, this is the most painful thing ever. You have no idea. I get it once. But it doesn't even matter because he's such a goddamn sponge. That's what's fucked up about it. Even if you do manage to get a perfect guard, it doesn't matter because he's a damage sponge. You can get his health down by maybe 1 if you're lucky. Meanwhile, he can pretty much kill you in one hit. Bullshit, man. 
you that! I used a special move and everything, and he got to kick me again. He actually got to kick me again, after his attack got stopped. There's just no winning with this guy. Look, look how little that I actually depleted his health, after getting a perfect goddamn guard. Even if you use... Hey, Hooded. Fortunately, I'm not in a very... Celebratory mood. Ah, you! Look at that, I get perfect guards off and everything, and I still barely do shit to him. This is a bullet sponge who also happens to take so much of your health away in one shot. This doesn't seem fair. Why does your why does why do your attacks do such little damage to him? Look at that. A two-bar attack. And it barely even does shit to him. You know what? I give up. This stream is over. He has bested me. I died 37 fucking times in this one live stream. I think that's 37 too many. I'm calling it. I don't know if I'm gonna beat this game, but it's sure as hell not gonna be now. I'm already going 30 minutes over my time limit here. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching me look like a dumbass for the last two hours and a half. I'm calling it. Sorry. Kizaro was best in me, that motherfucking light asshole. And of course, it starts it before the three minutes piece of shit because it's a piece of shit. Trust me, bro, you have no idea how grinded up my nerves are. I don't find anything funny about this. Wouldn't you like to know, Elisera? Wouldn't you like to know? Next live stream is planned to be Monday, 4.30 p.m. It's Fable Anniversary. More of this, maybe? I don't know. I mean, I could always go into one of the other two DLC stories if I can't get past this. Okay, be quiet right now. Let's Plays are every single day at high noon. News is next, fr is Friday, it's every Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, of course. If you enjoy watching me make a complete jackass out of myself, then feel free to subscribe and hit that bell icon to get your next fix. A like and a comment are always helpful, but I just hope you genuinely enjoyed yourself, and that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like a certain someone in the chats bad vibes and I will see you next time now go out there and capitalize on life peace out have a good one and have a nice and pleasant day I think it's finally time to end this and admit defeat see you later